just make, everybody all yeah, make sure it's, it's, it's right now it's, it's recording. ¿Cómo estamos? ¿Cómo estamos? Aquí estamos en la, con mi amigo. Yo soy Mecos. Miren, Mequitos. No, mi amigo uh, Clark de AK Game Farm. Aquí conmigo Kevin Shackleford. Uh, muy, muy conocido por el hijo de Dean Fair. I, uh, I interviewed your, your pops about, uh, what was it, like, um, two years ago? No, about four years ago? Four years ago? Yeah. Digo que hace como cuatro años entrevisté a su papá. I've always had a lot of respect for him, but when I went to actually go see him and, and you know, I used to talk to him, you know, you know, just for four or five minutes at, the, you know, the shows and stuff, the poultry shows, but that time when we stayed there for like, you know, talked to him for four or five hours, so knowledgeable. I mean, one of the greatest breeders. I mean, really, really knowledgeable. Been doing a long time. Yeah. I mean, he's, uh, he's a legend. You know, like I say, he's just, he's, uh, 50, 60 years. 70. Oh, 70, 70 years. 70, 70, 70, 70. 75 years old. Really? Yeah, yeah he's been doing it. I think he started off with Goob Brothers right. back when he was riding bicycle over there. He was a kid. Empezó con, el hijo de él empezó con, el papá de él empezó con los Goob Brothers. Uh, tiene ya 75 años, uh, Mr. Ding Ferry. He looks healthy, real healthy. Because huh? <laughs> he, he works, keep you busy. Because <laughs> he works every day. That's right. Dice que está muy sano porque trabaja todos los días. Um, Can you turn that off? Uh, thank you, brother. Um, ya compré nuevos micrófonos porque estaba mucho, muchas quejas. Uh, ¿Cómo se ve el sonido? Um, ¿se, escucha, ¿Se escucha bien el sonido ahí? A ver, amigos. Bueno, está bien. Uh, díganme si se, 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 se escucha bien el sonido o no. Um, uh, pero, can you do me a favor? Can you bring a bottle of that medicine? It's either uh, for me the truck or it's your dad's house. Oh. Please, thank you, brother. Um, so what, where, are you, where are you living at right now? I'm down in Waldo, Arkansas. What the hell are you doing in Arkansas? Well, I moved down there because at the time, Dink was in Shreveport. And, it, you know, I was close. I was just building the farm and it was easy access, and then, well, they moved up here to Kentucky, yeah. and him, you know, yeah. better ground, and, uh, well, Arkansas, it's, it's hard to beat the raised chickens, too, you know, you raise a real, a lot of nice, healthy son of a guns down there, and, and, uh, it's hard to beat. You were in Arkansas because you were talking about moving uh, to Oklahoma? Or, or Kentucky? Well, you know, I grew, I grew up in Oklahoma, so Oklahoma's always been home. It's a grew in I Oklahoma. Mean, but it looks just like this. It looks just like this part of Kentucky where I'm from. It was all rolling hills and Bermuda grass. In so, uh, Oklahoma? Yeah. How about America? Arkansas? We got a lot of Bahia grass and real humid and hot. But I mean, we're real sandy ground, so that, that helps us out quite a bit. Rolling? Your farm's rolling or is flat? No, my, my, my ground's flat. Okay. Pretty flat, but I got good drainage. Yeah. That's important how huh? you have good drainage on a farm because. Oh, you, yeah. It washes away all the feces and yeah, you you don't you don't want to be raising in the swamp, but. Que es muy importante tener un un rancho donde haya buen drenaje. Thank you, brother. Appreciate that. Eh, buen drenaje uh, por las enfermedades. Uh, what kind what kind of breeds are you raising right now? Sweater Kelso, got some blacks, Albanies, and I just got me some round heads. <laughs> Dice que tiene sweater Kelso, unos prietos. Uh, Albanese, and unos roundheads que le compró aquí a Clark. How'd you like the roundheads from? Well, my, my original roundheads were the Lacy's, and I got them from Mac White, and Dink picked them up for me. And uh, they just getting a little bit inbred and stuff, so Your I needed original... some roundhead blood to I knew wouldn't hurt them, put back in them. Into oh, into, in, into your councils? No, no, into round my roundheads, so I could save my roundheads because they were starting to get a little inbred, and so I was going to use Clark's to put into mine. Okay, you, are they getting kind of short, your roundheads, or? Well, um, they, they were already pretty inbred when I got them. Okay. So and uh, these are going to help with the height a little bit and put some, you know, just some fresh blood in. Uh, que tiene unos roundheads muy buenos, pero que ya están muy este, refinados y que vino aquí con Clark para agarrar unos roundheads de él para reforzar la sangre de él. Uh, how, do you, how exactly do you breed, in, breed a, a family into and breed it out? Or are you going to keep it separate, or are you going to breed it and breed it out, or you breed it in for a while and check it out and then breed it out? Well, my bread and butter is, is mostly the sweaters, Kelsos, and Albany's. Mm -hmm. Now, I do I do have the blacks, and I got the flare eyes, and the roundheads I'll use in 
I'll make me crosses with. Okay. But the way I breed them in, and you'll breed it in and breed it back out, is I'll breed them half and half, and then I'll take, you know, the bullets out of them, put them over, back over one of my other cocks. On both and sides. It, on both was, sides. And see which was which was the better. Yeah, right? it's all trial and error. Yeah, and it yeah, it is. It's all trial and error. Que, que su base son los Albany's, Kersons, y sus sweaters, pero que también tiene los prietos, los topis, y también los cabezas de redonda. Entonces lo que él hace es los cruza con sus cabezas de redonda de él, mitad y mitad, y luego las hijas se la pone a un lado y, y al otro lado, y ya ve cuál lado le gusta más. Um, your Kelsos and Albany's and your uh, sweaters, they're from your daddy? Yeah. Oh, yeah. So, yeah. Uh, que sus signas son las mismas signas de su papá. Your Kelsos are right, white legged or yellow legged? White legged. Tiene los Kelsos white legged. Real smart. No? I'm going to be honest. I don't see. The way I've got mine bred and the way I've, I've bred them, they're, uh, they're coming. Yeah. I mean, they're. And I breed them. There, there's not a lot of difference between them, I don't think, in my sweaters. Okay. Uh, que son muy parecidos a sus sweaters con su yale. Uh, otra cosa que quiero mencionar también es este, que toda la práctica de aquí es para puro show. No, no este, autorizamos ni hablamos nada. De, uh, all the talk we're doing right here is off for show and for, uh, for, breeding, for breeding purpose I'm only. Really we don't uh, condone or or promote any kind of illegal activities here in the country. So um, that's just a little All disclaimer right. there. Um, so how long have you been in chickens then? Did, did you... well, I mean, I grew up around it. Uh, so I guess most of my life, you know, but I was always under dad and stuff till I'd say this 2009 is when I bought my farm in Arkansas. Que tiene su papá con su vida con su papá y hasta el 2009 empezó a, a se separó. Uh, you got a cell phone number that people can call you? I do. It's uh, 727-804-7929. Okay, repeat again. 727-807-804-7929. Ese es su celular. Do you have a Facebook account? I do. It's Kevin Shackelford. Uh, está como en, en uh, Facebook, como Kevin Shafter. Si quieren el, 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 el nombre contacto, este, manden un inbox y yo con gusto le doy el nombre, le mando el link de su, de su Facebook. También quiero promocionar este, mi nuevo Bugabi Pro uh, que estamos usando ahorita. Es el que con lo que ganamos ahí en, en León, Guanajuato. Lo usamos en la cuida, también en la punteada. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. He tried my vitamins, he likes it a lot too. Um, we used this in, the, in uh, León, Guanajuato uh, for the feeding and for the pointing. Rosh also works real well with the uh, with the molt right now. También juega muy bien en la en la en la en la en la en la pluma. Cascabeles won a uh, day before yesterday. Oh, they won day before yesterday. Yeah. Well, they f they f really fought on the El Roble and Infierno, but there were some uh, Cascabeles okay. roosters. Oh, okay. And que uh, llegan antes llegan no Cascabeles el la Octerola. Bueno, ganó más bien ganó el Infierno y ganó el Roble. Creo que algunos ganadores eran de Cascabeles y ayer felicidades a Carboneras. Carboneras won it yesterday yeah, in uh, San Miguel del Alto. Un saludo a Don Daniel, un saludo a Partido a Cascabeles y un saludo para él, para El Bombón, que fue el empresario. Um, we got to go down to Mexico. You never been to Mexico? Uh, you know, I've been to Chihuahua. Here that's, recently. Not, that's not really Mexico. I'm not going to get in trouble, Gary. We, we had no. good time down there. Can you feel uh, Chihuahua? But, no, I, you know, I don't hardly get to get away from the farm for very long, so... It's a, but I definitely want to get down there. Yeah. I've all, I've always liked going to Mexico. We've got cart yeah, down there, and now I might have to go down there yeah. and visit. Oh, we'll get you in trouble. Yeah. We'll oh, get you yeah, in a lot of trouble. Right. No, 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 I ain't gonna huh? get no trouble. No, 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 no. <laughs> uh, yeah, I mean, you know, he's he's more than welcome. You know, we'll help him any way we can. You know, he's always helped me in the past, and you know, we're good buddies, and then uh, you know, we always uh, try to help each other when we can. We'll be we'll be in Mexico. Uh, you know. Uh, uh, competing every every week, so if you want to come down there, come and see us. You know, well, you yeah, want to the farm. Yeah. That'd be great. We got an extra bed there and yeah. lots of food. And yeah. you're single or you got you're married? Oh, I'm single. We'll uh -huh. get you married down there. Uh, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yes, well, I am single. Yeah. <laughs> we'll get you married and divorced in a couple <laughs> weeks. Tiene tiene esposa que es soltero. Ya ya lo casamos y lo divorciamos de volada. 
Yeah. 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 You want to say hello to your wife? Yeah, hello. How about your girlfriend? Hello. Hasta luego. No, but we're, we're excited. excited. We're, we got ready. Let me get to the point of rojo, muchachito. <laughs> but we're real excited for Clark. We're, we're ready to see him go down there and see, you know. Well, you know, if you don't Clark win that battle, I'm, I'm throwing back over the border back to you guys. Que si no gana la pocha, usted para atrás, para allá, para acá, para... para you gonna do all right down there, I promise you that. Now we partner up, we're, we're, we all, I mean, we're like this all day long, and we're just fucking... Well, we fucking like to joke you. and get up and have fun and... And, you know, we, we work real hard, so, you know, we like to joke, and it just makes it a little bit better and fun, you know, as we go along. We got good friends to share everything with, and, good. you know, a lot, yeah. of, a lot of good people that helps us out, you know, my partner, you know, Chubbs and everybody, and uh, it's uh, it's hard to beat, you know. Yeah, que tenemos buen equipo. Fun camaraderie. Su socio aquí de Chubbs, y nosotros tenemos buen equipo también. Hay mucho respeto. Um, you know, we kid around, but we, we, we respect each other a lot. Yeah, so we it's just, each other. It's all about respect in the first, you know. Business. You know, he's got his job. He's the, he's the pointer. You know, Chubb's the breeder. I'm kind of like the salesman manager. Best handler in the world. El Chubb's es el creador y él también es creador. Bombón para Dini. Este, a mí me dicen el bombón para Dini. El mejor saltador de México ya ahorita. No, but uh, Mexico is fun though. You gotta come down there. It, oh yeah, I'd, I'd love to come down. The intercontinental. Right. Inter well, I'll, I'll behave. Intercontinental still real, real fun. I mean, uh, all the big boys go down there, uh, especially the Golden Rooster. They have, they have uh, que el, que el go uh, va muchos gringos allá en el Golden. Um, the it's pits more for breeders. It's the breeders, pits breeders, inside, yes. inside the, the pits inside the hotel. So it's a, ho the ho it's, a re it's a resort. It's a Resort, five star, five star oh, resort. Okay. So we got swimming pool, re fancy restaurants, uh, and the pits inside the inside the hotel. Yeah. So you don't have to leave. The, you don't have to leave the building. Well, that's all right. Yeah. It sounds sounds like good time. Wake up, go out. <laughs> you know, <laughs> look at chickens look, go. Look at chickens and, Come uh, back, yeah. Uh, Real safe. Lo estoy invitando al al Golden si quiere ir este. Que es un ambiente muy bonito. Va muchos gringos allá. But uh, we, yeah, we're excited about this year, though. We're really yeah, I'm, well, we're excited for you. We're we're keeping track of you. We you know, like them old sweaters and them round heads famous. Oh, yeah, that's right. <laughs> <laughs> the sweaters and round heads, yeah. The the sweater man and the round head man. You mm -hmm. know. Well, what's your best What's your best cross? Your most favorite cross? Okay, cross before the cross. I'm talking about. You know, I don't know that I actually have a favorite. Because if I really thought I had one that I thought was that much better, I'd, all probably, that's breed. all I'd breed. Yeah. Uh, but. I would, I would say, say I get more requests for sweaters and Kelso crosses. Mm -hmm. But, I, I mean, I, I like the Albanese yeah, myself. The Albanese, they, they, I think the Albanese are probably a little more naturally my kind of style. Dice que mucha gente pide por sus sweaters y por sus Kelsos, pero a él le gustan mucho los Albanese. They come uh, straight home, pico? Mine are pico. Yellow leg, dark or, or lemon heckle? Dark. Because those yeah, albanese are morados. Este... I, I've got a few straight comb sweaters. Uh, that, you know, the old throwback. Out, but, uh, and I like them too. I just, I don't, I'm not much of a, I, I don't like trimming them. I like it, yeah, exactly. <laughs> you know, <Yeah. laughs> I don't like trimming them. <laughs> so, but yeah. if you get the straight comb sweaters, they'll, they'll still throw mostly pecone yeah. for the most part, unless you're yeah. actually really breeding for it. Que sus sweaters son uh, really good. Cruz caída, este, do they come every come in white leg? Your sweaters or no? No, no, no mine haven't. All your leg. Yeah. Rule lemon hackle. Well, the bad I cats come a little I darker, mean, but but yeah. I mean they're going to be orange, orangey red. Sí, que, que son este, uh, your dad has a saying that. Uh, the color of money. The color of money is orange. Yeah, the golden boy. Yeah, the color of money. 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 Now, I mean, if, if, if I got two that are ad identical and I think I can't decide between them, then I'll look at color. Yeah. Que dice que tiene dos que están idénticos, que son igual de buenos, que sí se va el color, pero not, not. But most of mine, most of mine are more of an orangey red. Uh, white streamers? White heckles or no? Well, you gotta have white streamers. Mm -hmm. I mean, I, I, I like chrome That's on chrome. my chicken. I like chrome on my chicken. Yes, blancas, este, abajo del, muy blanco abajo. Like your daddy, huh? Oh, yeah. Um, them toppies are hard to raise, huh? 
Uh, the, the, to raise the pure toffees, they are. I think, I think if a guy really wanted to raise a bunch of pure ones, you almost need to keep them to their cells. They're, when they're first born, they're a little bit smaller, so they tend to get picked on a little bit. Yeah, yeah. Now, once you get them 8, 12 weeks old, you're fine. You're fine. Is that because they're so inbred? No, it's just because they're... That's just their... Que sus topis, the way they uh, are, they're yeah. smaller. Hay, yeah. hay que sacarlos aparte porque son, vienen más chiquitos y a veces los, los pican los más grandes. Pero ya cuando desde seis, ocho semanas ya funcionan muy bien. But, uh, and they're, you know, the thing about topis are they're, they're very good crossing fowl. Pure, they're short. I mean, they, they, they look like old timey chickens, but they cross so well. Que sus topis este, son muy chaparros, that, pero que cruzan muy bien con todo. That, that's what makes them worth keeping. Okay. Um... Big or not? Yeah, yeah, everybody likes a big knot. Yeah. Like that big knot. Más competitive and más bonito. Yeah. That your daddy got it from Junior Bell, right? Or no? Years ago. Because papá se lo agarró con Junior Bell. Um, did, you, did your dad bring any sweater into them or or just did it came I don't, I don't want to talk about how he what he done with them. Uh, uh, yeah, 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 you got to talk to him on how, different. on how what he did. Uh, but I've got mine, and they got they got a little. They're they're getting inbred a little, okay. you know. But I I've, I've tried to make enough of them and spread it out as far as I can go back. Bring you know, cousins, uncle, cousins, the yeah. cousin, yeah. niece, que lo, and. Que si está un poquito refinado, pero trata de de agarrar este nietos con perdón perdón este so, uh, tías con las sobrinos o a vice versa. Um, See, I've been I've been pretty uh, fortunate, you know, having. Being, being my father and stuff, that I didn't have to do a lot of this yeah. tight inbreeding to set the lines. I mean, the family lines were pretty well. Line. Yeah, they were already the genes were locked in right. for me okay. for the most part. Right. So I can I can go back and go uncle and niece and you be fine. You know, yeah. grandfather, granddaughter. If I need to keep the line. Que él tuvo suerte porque su papá ya tenía bien reforzadas las líneas y bien bien apretadas las líneas que se llama. Cuando la ya la tienes bien apretado y ya salen uniformes. And they come, all come uniform, right? Yeah. Y puede ahorita agarrar una, una sobrina con un, con un tío y, y le funciona muy bien. So somebody can come over to your house and get a Kelso or a sweater and, and you can give them the same lines too, right? So they can, they don't have to invent anything, right? You can, you recommend well, them getting like a, a brewcock and like two sides of the family or what do you recommend somebody buying? Well, it just depends on what they're wanting to do with them. Uh, but, you know, I got like anywhere from 40 brood pins and it sounds like a lot but you know i can do five <laughs> ten sweater brood pins ten kelso and and so on but that gives me the room to where i don't have to do the real tight I, i try to keep myself out of a corner reading into a corner tiene 40 lotes y por eso él puede crear sin sin meterse muy apretado a la línea tan refinado para mantener sus familias bien um what do you get for your for your uh brood fowl? Well, for uh, a stag and bullets, it's fourteen fifty shipped. For two stag, for one stag and two and two bullets. Yeah. Uh, Mil cuatrocientos cincuenta ya ya enviado anywhere in the states, right? Huh? Anywhere in the states, right? Anywhere in the in the states. Mil cuatrocientos cincuenta el trio. Uh, Brewcock. It depends on what I've got. Uh, I I try not to hold too many cocks over if I can, but uh, that's just kind of a matter of correspondence. Yeah. Okay. You know, it's. You, I, I don't. You, I don't want to say because a lot of times I don't. You rather sell trios. Yeah. Okay. And so it wants an extra hen. How much you get for a hen? Or you rather sell trios? Pullets. He don't keep much two year olds. That's what he's trying to say. No, but how much do you have for ask for a pullet? Here. Three fifty. Three hundred and fifty for the polla. Es lo que es lo que pide. Um, so That's shit. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So if somebody wanted to have your your sweaters, you recommend him. Having two line, two both lines of the sweaters, or what do you recommend to somebody? I want to, I want to get your sweaters, and I want to ha keep them for a long time, for 10, 20 years. What do I do? What do I buy from you? Hey, you buy trail sweaters, but you tell me that you know. And and I always ask people like, it, are you you're wanting to breed them, keep them, you know, so you can make your own family? I can do a lot of times, not all the time, but I can try to get you sisters, okay, you know, if it's possible, or I can get you. Two different, yeah, cousins. you know, cousins, yeah. and then you can single mate or put them all together. Que, que si yo quiero un trío de él y, y quiero mantener una familia, ¿qué, qué me recomienda? 
Como yo quiero esos guaros, digo que trata de darme dos hermanas o dos primas para que no estén muy, muy llegadas al, al gallo para poder hacer sus líneas. Um, I mean, I, I just you know, I, I don't really want to tell people how to breed them because that's all on you. I mean, that's that's kind of yeah. that that's up to how you what you're going for, and uh, you know, there's there's no it's there's no the, guarantees it's the, that it's in the uh, eye of the beholder. You know what I'm saying? You know, big big, big Jim, uh, uh, my buddy's father, he said that most good families are ac were accidents. You know? Yeah, it's trial and error. All of it. <laughs> you know. It, there's no guarantees no, on anything. No yeah. Digo, I mean, digo I, Jim que, que no hay garantías. Uh, digo Pete Jim que un amigo mío, este, que casi todas las familias son accidentes. Digo, pues no hay garantía en esto, o sea, son animales. I mean, there's there's a lot of, but crosses have done very well, and that's one of the things that's really helped the sweaters and stuff is that they they cross real well and, and the things yeah. and you know, round I think everybody's really. You keep the, a lot of people are doing the pure for their brood and their seed pal, and they're doing a lot of crosses. Right. And, and it's, that's just because it really helps out with the all around health. And, mm -hmm. you know, you're making basically hybrids right. when you're crossing. Okay. Dice, cuando haces un gallo muy refinado, pues, este, tiene más problemas con la salud. Cuando haces un, este, mitad, mitad, pues, haces más un gallo más híbrido, más, más salud, más, este, más estamina, porque es un híbrido. It's a hybrid, right? Yeah. yeah, well, I mean, you're, yeah, you're, you're putting that fresh blood in them. That's going to help all the time. Uh, they're doing very well with uh, sweaters and grays, sweaters blacks. Uh, yeah, well, they, they hire me to go. Kelso black. I mean, Kelso hatch used to be real famous. Or roundhead hatches yeah. were. Hatch roundheads. Hatch roundheads were famous. Que los hatch que son muy famosos. Yeah, I'm, we we got hired to go to Philippines. I got hired to go to Philippines too, yeah. to breed some of that Mexican blood into them. But they run him out of the country. So you might yeah. even have them maquilas a maquilas a este a a las Filipinas, pero no pude entrar. They got jealous and the men oh. voted me out. <laughs> <laughs> nah. All right. Well, I appreciate um, your your time. Um, well, uh, before we finish off, what, tell me about your blacks. Well, now, I, I ain't had the blacks for a long time. I got the blacks from uh, Joe Boy out of Hawaii. And, it, you know, originally it started because he wanted me to put them into some sweaters and he was mom making in. Uh, mm -hmm. They just kind of hit. And you like him? He wanted to buy a bunch of them and then, you know, to make, to make them like that. Que tiene unos, yeah, unos prietos de Hawaii y que le gustaron mucho. And then they actually, they, they turned out really good, but, but now I didn't have no, I mean, when I got the blacks, they were already the way they were. I mean, I didn't, I didn't help them or improve them. I just, he gave them to me and then I crossed them on the sweaters and it just, it kicked. Uh -huh. Que so it, un amigo de, uh, de Hawaii le quería que le criara a él, entonces le mandó unos prietos, los cruzó con sus sweaters y que, que, este, ligaron muy bien. Oh, I'm glad. Um, where would you, where, where would you see your dad? Well, I ain't told him I'm in Kentucky right now. <laughs> oh, because I didn't go by there to see him. You're, you're, the you're, you're off the wheel, so buddy. So as they see this, yeah. you're, you're, you're off the wheel. <laughs> I was on my way. <laughs> but uh, you, I, get, I get to go see him once or twice a year. Okay, you, mm. you get, you're off the wheel. Huh? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you better go, go see your daddy, buddy. You know, you know this, this was a... Last minute right. plan. He just jumped in the truck. <laughs> yeah, I just jumped in the truck. Right. I'm not driving, right. so. But now I'm gonna I'm gonna go up there and see him probably in about a month. You tell me say hi. Cause see I've got an uncle down here too in uh, in London. In London, yeah. Cuando cada vez papá yo cada dos veces por año dijo, aquí estás en Tokio y es di no no no. Ahora que no me vea porque me va a regañar porque no fui a verlo. Nah, that's good. Uh, your dad's a smart man. I mean, I, I have a lot of respect for your father. I mean. Mm -hmm. He'd been in it a long time, and he, you know, not trying to brag on, but, you know, he's like all around. You know, he yeah. started off competing and, the and training, the world, and then, you know? you know, started getting into the breeding yeah. and, you know, a lot of hard work. Been there and done that. Sé que tu papá tiene muchas jugando, bueno, jugó mucho tiempo y pues tiene una chatera muy bonita. Um, Bush one time, you know, Bush Williamson, you know him? Yeah. Uh, un amigo, mi amigo Bush, un saludo a Bush. 
um, he said that um, a customer called me. Hey, give me a give me a sweater uh, trip from Dink. So he calls your daddy. How much? You know, thirteen hundred, twelve twelve hundred, whatever it was. And then uh, Bush tells the guy, yeah, twelve hundred or thirteen hundred. He goes, tell me I want a real good one. I'll give him uh, three thousand for him. You know, the best one. He calls Dink and hey, he says he'll give you three thousand or for the best trio. I go, He's gonna get the same trio for twelve hundred. I mean, <laughs> <laughs> well, you know, you know, I've actually, I've, I've actually heard him say that. He's like, you you're okay? It's yeah. fine. But I mean, I already got him picked. Right. You, I mean, you're going to get him. Yeah. Que, you know. que, que este, que un cliente de un amigo de Bush le pidió un trio de Dink y le dijo, ¿cuánto vale? Por mil trescientos. Dijo y dijo el, el mexicano, le dijo, le dije que le doy tres mil por él y ya le dijo a, a Dink, le dije que le que da tres mil por él y dijo Dink, pues, me agarra el mismo el mismo trío. Entonces, este, ya, he paid the But, you know, that, then that's one thing that, honest. you know, I, I think he's, he's always told me, it was, you know, if, if you're going to stay in it, you got, you got to send people, oh, yeah. you know, what you'd be happy right. getting, you know, you, and stuff. And he's always done that, so. Dice que su know, papá he, siempre ha mandado lo que sabe que le va a dar bueno a los gallos, a la gente, porque por, por eso he's, ha tenido tanto, tanto. Good, honest business. That's what he's been yeah. in. I mean, you can, there's a saying in. In English, says, uh, you can shear a lamb a thousand times, but you're going to skin him once, you know? That's right. Yeah. That's, 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 that's the truth. He sent me three dollars for a trio. I threw my sister in there, too. Right. <laughs> you know, this, this is a small, and it's a tight community. Mm -hmm. You know, if things start going wrong. wrong they're gonna, they're gonna, yeah, people going to hear. They're going to talk. People, yeah. and... And it's going to get around. Mm -hmm. So, you know, part of it is you need to keep your reputation yeah. up and you need to send good. And Your you know. name means everything. Yeah. You know, your name means everything, you know. Oh, yeah. Dice que es, es una comunidad muy, 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 muy chiquita y que cuando haces cosas buenas, todo el mundo sabe. Cuando haces cosas malas, también todo el mundo se da cuenta también. Um, do you like, um, so you don't, you don't do any kind of sister or sister, sister or brother, maybe? Or, or daddy was... Daughter? And every now and then, but I don't I don't really have to that much. Like I said, I, I've got so many friends right. and stuff that I've, I've got them to where you I can don't do need it. them get them that tight. And then you know, options. Then, yeah, I've got yeah. options. Got and options. And having Dink as a father, you know. Yeah. That, oh, yeah. That, <laughs> don't hurt, that don't hurt that none, don't at none at all. That ain't going to hurt you. You can go back to him and get anything you want. Yeah. Well, <laughs> you lucky bastard. <laughs> <laughs> We're family. Yeah. <laughs> Actually, when I went to your, with your, he offered me to give me whatever I wanted, and and I didn't take it. I wasn't bringing anything back then. I didn't want to take an advantage of the situation, you know. Somebody gives me something, I'm not going to give it away or sell yeah. it, you know. Que cuando fui con Dink, me ofreció lo que yo quería regalado. No quise ganar nada porque porque no lo ocupaba. La verdad, no 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 estaba teniendo en ese tiempo. But he, he treated me really really well. Yeah. Him and your brother were there. Blake. Yeah. Yeah. Blake. That's a good kid. Oh yeah. He gonna be. He'd be a chicken man if he wants. Yeah, he yeah, if, he, if he wants, he can. Mm -hmm. He's in a great position. Oh, hell yeah, yeah. Oh, I mean, yeah. he like he has some ACOs that he just got that tight. Mm -hmm. yeah. yeah. I don't know if he still got them or not, but. Yeah, he, he probably still got them. You got, you, they, you like ACOs or no? They, I got some. I got some. I got some. I mean, you know what? <laughs> <laughs> I, and and, and I, I ain't going to say nothing bad about ACOs because I, I, I see good ones. Mm -hmm. But it's really hard for me to throw feed to an A-seal yeah. when he's standing next to a sweater. Yeah. I mean, I... Que tiene asiles, pero que más uno le gustan, pero que... But now they make, feel. But they make you like them, because yeah. I tell you what, they don't bite. No. I mean, I can pick some of them up and put them on right. thing, right off thing, and just pet them. Never pero que muy mansitos. Uh, my buddy, you know, Luke Breezy from Missouri? Yeah. Yeah, he said uh, he, was, he raised sweaters one year and sold every one of them. The next year, he's... So, what, what are your sweaters doing? I go, I, I don't got them no more. I go, how come? God damn, they're so fucking goddamn ugly. Yeah. <laughs> well, I tell you, me? though, the ACLs have been doing very well. And they'll come in and then they'll start to, because people are going to change. Oh, yeah. You know, I mean, once you got a, a style that's doing, they, you, all them breeders, everybody's going to start coming up with, that with something. That, 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 yeah. I mean, yeah, to compete against that. Que la gente so it, it'll make que, a circle que, back. Que, yeah. va, va a pasar un tiempo que la gente va a empezar a, a, a sacar cruces que le van a ganar los asiles y se van a ir en modas. I'll tell you a quick story. Una historia que yo, que yo le compraba yo a, a Brian Corcoran y, y fuimos a comprar unas, unos, uh, unas bolilas 
Y llegamos con un creador y tenía como unos 300. Era la, cuando era la, lo fuerte de la, del suéter. Y fue con un creador y tenía 300 gallinas sueltas. 200, 300. Y de verdad es que son puras, ¿no? Son, son este suero cruzadas tres veces, dos cruzas, tres cruzadas. ¿Y para qué las quieres? No, pues aquí todos los creadores aquí de la Baba vienen y compran las sueros a 15 dólares y la venden como tríos. I told him I went to go see Brian one day and, and we went to buy um, some of Wilinas, Mexican carrying boxes and uh, went to a white guy and he had 200, 300 hens running loose. Oh, let me, let me hackle, yellow leg. Right. And I go, what, are they all pre -order? He goes, no, they're all three-way, four-way crosses, two-way crosses. I go, what do you want them for? I go, all the, Mer all the Alabama breeders come here and buy them and sell them as trios. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I swear to trios. Yeah. So you, ha you have a lot of that going on with the yeah, ACOs yeah, too. Well, I mean, good ACLs are, are big, but like I said, you know, they'll go for, so, I think they'll go for so long, and then you're going to get guys that are going to start coming come up, up with, with yeah, they're going to they're come up with something that'll right. go against them. Round heads. Round heads. Yeah, well, yeah. I mean, you're going to get the And they'll start making, call them the they'll make the circle, they'll come in, and then they'll, you know, I, they're never going to go completely away, but, oh, yeah. you know. There for what about two, three years ago, you could have sold thousand yeah, ACO whatever, cross. Que hace dos mil, dos tres años. I mean, that's what yeah. everybody was looking for. I got a, a friend of mine who, in Alabama. He, I won't say mention his name, but three years ago he raised like 500 ACOs, sold every one of them. Now he's got like 500 ACOs that he hasn't sold. He can't yeah. sell anymore. Y una, un amigo mío en Alabama, creo como 500 hace dos, dos años, todos los vendió a Siles, cruzas, y ya tiene, tiene 500 y nadie los quiere. Nobody wants them anymore. Well, a couple of years ago, I, I was telling them, I, I had calls, you know, we need 500 A-seal crosses. Mm -hmm. I don't have no A-seals. Mm -hmm. yeah. I was like, you know, I know so-and-so's got some. Mm -hmm. You know, you can call them. They're supposed to be pretty good. But I, right. I got sweaters and, you know, right. crosses and stuff. Well, these guys just want the A-seal crosses. Right. But I ain't, I ain't got no, now I got some A-seals. Mm -hmm. <laughs> and... I'm not getting a lot of calls for them. Dice que tiene asile, pero no tiene muchas llamadas. Are you to keep breeding them? No, probably not. Um, I mean, I'll probably keep them around, but I'm not. I really did them more for myself for fun. Que lo que lo que lo tiene para trial, no sé él, pero testing. Que lo va a probar, pero no está muy. Pero no piensa que lo va a seguir criando porque no es su estilo, pero que lo va a seguir criando a ver a ver qué sale. But yeah, I'm. Like I said, most most everybody that I, I come to, they're looking for sweaters, Kelsos, Albany, or, you know, some crosses. Oh, I'll remind everybody to please uh, comment and share this video. Por favor, comenten y comparten. Yo no cobro por las entrevistas, no estoy ganando nada. Yo lo hago por ayudar a la gente y, y más les, les pido, si pueden algún día comprar mi Bugabi Pro, Comprenle, es un producto muy, muy bueno. Este, y comparten en los videos y comenten. Ayuda mucho. También en mi canal, también en, en, um, en YouTube, estoy como Navajas Bugarín. También estoy como Bugarín TV, Bugarín Live. Y tengo una página que se llama bugarintv.com. Ahí puedes ver este eventos en vivo. Bueno, eventos ya pasados. Eh, y este videos de Amare también. Uh, you can go to bugarintv.com. You can watch uh, um, tournaments. You can watch... Uh, Batine and stuff like that from different uh, handlers and breeders. Um, you know, the, the handler, the, the, the tire is the least <laughs> on the team, you know? <laughs> yeah, right. Like I said, we're real excited for you yeah. and Clark. We're, we're ready to see y'all go down I think, there. I, I, think, I, I think there yeah. had been a white boy tying in the middle of a, in a Leon in Four. probably 20 years. 30, 40 <laughs> yeah. years. Que primera vez que tienen un gringo en el... En el We're going to integrate some gringos yeah. in down there. That's right. The funny part home. is, he was tying his... He didn't, met, he didn't see it, but he was tying his finger to the wood. Que estaba mandando su dedo. I go, Clark! And he's like, oh, oh okay. <laughs> <laughs> Trying to you're sneak gonna, in the socket gonna... on y'all, huh? Right. <laughs> nah. <laughs> Right, That's what we're right. talking about, though. You know, huh? it's it's all business there, but you can still have a good time. Uh, we, we, we have good play all day long. Camaraderie. Yeah. 
He Good put, people. He, he, I was lying down trampoline yesterday. He said he saw me and he said I found a stray dog and people were putting it on their tree. Va- vaccinate him. Yeah. He looked like he's got rabies. <laughs> well, you know you gotta watch what this guy says. Read his shirt there. Yeah. Relax, Green Gun Legal. Dice, relájate, Gringo, soy legal. Nah, pero todavía estamos ahí jugando, pasamos bien. But we, we really appreciate you having us out. No, no problem. No problem. Thank, Thank you very much. Out, and uh, you know? like I said, we'll, we'll be working with Cascabeles, and we'll have our own. Uh, we have our own team too, um, and we'll be uh, competing in the tough, toughest places in first, uh, level. Mex- first level. Vamos a competiendo en, en primer nivel. Uh, si alguien quiere cementales, alguien quiere grandes cuidados, este, manda un inbox. If somebody wants, uh, you know, uh, uh, cross stuff or stuff ready to compete in Mexico, yeah. in Mexico, we're going to have uh, really good stuff. So we're excited. Right. Yeah, saludos, saludos to todos mis amigos in Mexico. Uh, I'd like to thank everybody for coming out, you know, um, uh, Junior, you know, Bang high, you know, a lot of my friends that come out here to see me to Kentucky, you know, Kevin, you know, uh, just really appreciate everybody and, uh, uh, you know, very, very happy to have everybody, everybody out here. So. Thank you very much. Dios lo bendiga a todos.